हेलो फ्रेंड्स टुडे वी विल सी हाउ टू कनेक्ट सीलिंग फैन विथ सप्लाई सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वी शुड नो सीलिंग फैन कॉन्सेप्चुअली सो इन सीलिंग फैन टू वाइंडिंग विल बी देर वन विल बी स्टार्टिंग वाइंडिंग एंड वन विल बी रनिंग वाइंडिंग हियर रोटर विल बी एक्चुअली आउटसाइड ऑफ स्टेटर the starting winding and running winding will be in stator and this rotor will be outside of the stator but to show here it is shown inside of the stator now whenever you are see a ceiling fan you will come to know that there will be three terminals in ceiling fan likewise here here we are having three terminals from ceiling fan now if we need to connect these three terminals to supply we we will see today how to connect that so this is the connection diagram and if you will broke this connection diagram to this one so here we will come to know that uh, this starting winding and running winding is joined at this point so that this is having three terminals this is the first terminal and this is second terminal and this is the third terminal which we are having over here this is this may be first this may be second and this may be third terminal now how we can identify which is this uh, first terminal which is second terminal and which is third terminal first second and third terminal if we want to check that first terminal second terminal and third terminal we need to have a multimeter and we can check that how we can ident how to identify common or joint connection of two winding of stator of ceiling fan so for that we need to measure resistance between all these terminal second and third first and second and first and third whichever winding will be having higher resistance the other terminal other than that two terminals will be the common terminal means joint terminal this is the joint terminal so we will check that in our fan so first of all we need to put our multimeter into resistance knob now we will check the resistance between all terminals so this is having some 135 ohm resistance this yellow and red terminal is having 73.6 ohm resistance and yellow and green is having that we have checked already and this is having 99.2 ohm resistance so we can see here that this yellow and green is having maximum resistance so this red will be the joint terminal which has came from inside of the fan here we can see that this is this one is red terminal so we will write here this is the red terminal which we are having this is the red terminal which is connected over here so red terminal is joined from inside and it is coming outside now we should know the reason why red terminal is having or between red terminal and second terminal we are having less resistance and between this second and third ter terminal we are having higher resistance because we come to know that between second and third terminal we are having two windings so resistance will be more here we are having only one winding so between first and second we are having less resistance so by this way we come to know that this this two terminal will be having lower resistance so if this two terminal is having higher resistance so the other terminal other than these two terminals will be the common terminal which is connected over here so in our fan we will now give supply 
first of all we will connect our fan so here we will be having starting winding running winding in series with starting winding we need to connect a capacitor and uh, this second terminal of running winding will be connected along with the capacitor now this is this is the terminal box where we need to connect our all terminals these three terminals should be connected over here now we have come to know that this red terminal is a common point which has came from inside of the motor or inside of the stator here the starting winding and running winding is coming from the stator starting winding will be having less resistance because it will be having less number of turns running winding will be having more resistance because it will be having more number of turns but we will not come to know that which terminal is from starting winding and which terminal is from running winding but by this test we come to know that this terminal is common and these will be the two terminals which will be having higher resistance now to this connector how to connect all terminals that we will see so as we come to know that the red terminal this is the red wire we can say this is the terminal that we are having here so this terminal is the phase terminal okay so we will connect this terminal to phase so red terminal is connected over here here we will be giving supply now between these two we should connect a capacitor so because if we will see here between this terminal and this terminal capacitor should be connected so uh, here we are having this two terminal yellow and green here we will be connecting a capacitor now between this green terminal between this green and uh, yellow terminal we are having a capacitor this green terminal should be connected at the bottom and this terminal after joining should be connected to the middle connector now if we will give supply over here our motor will run and our fan will run that we will see after giving supply so this red terminal has been connected over here that we have connected over here this yellow terminal along with a capacitor terminal is connected over here so that we will draw this green sometimes it may be blue or sometimes it may be black is connected along with a capacitor terminal it is connected over here so it will be like this here we need to give phase supply and here we need to give neutral so this is the connector which is having five ter terminal knobs so here likewise our fan connection will be there after giving the supply phase and neutral this fan should run so here we have connected supply uh, red to red and this neutral is connected at the bottom so now we will give supply to this motor 
so it is rotating so friends likewise we can connect fan with the supply and from next time i hope you not you not need to go to electrician so that you can save some of your money and here i complete thank you